Hi beauties, it's Jean Persani with Beauty and the Stamper. Oh, you guys, it's my paper pumpkin time. So I got this in the mail today. And I had to open it to show you guys. So let's go ahead and see what's in it. I've been so excited because I heard that it is supposed to be super cute. So let's see. Okay, first things first, you guys. They've got an advertisement in here about that tool, the new pickup tool. So today I went to the post office. If you follow me on Instagram, you'll already know that I sent each of my Paper Pumpkin subscribers a nice, cute little gift. And then one of you, I actually sent one of these pickup tools. So each month I'm gonna pick one subscriber for um, of mine that uh, subscribes to Paper Pumpkin and give them one of these tools. So if you want to be a subscriber, if you're not already, check the link down below and sign up, you guys. Super cute stuff. So, and this tool is awesome. All right, so time to go ahead and get opening, huh? So let me, well, <laughs> this is black instead of the normal, um, pretty teal blue color and then let's see all right first things first they've got this basic gray stamp and spot which normally it's clear and it's all black today so we've got the black um, box and the stamp and spot is the basic gray color then we've got these and let me get a piece of white paper here so you can see it it's got a little piece of cardboard in there from the paper pumpkin box so all right look at that can you see it let me see there we go so we've got spooky we've got what is that oh it's a bat a little bat. We've got a pumpkin or jack-o'-lantern. We've got the words boo and eek. What else do we have here? It says frights and delights. Some to and from. It's Halloween. Treats for you. There's a star, a little spider, a bigger spider, and then another kind of like little star as well. So really cute. Really cute. So, it looks as if we're going to be making treats. Let's open it up and see what we've got in here. So, of course, the first thing they send you is the directions with a nice picture of what you're going to be making this month. And so, there's some eeks some booze with some bats and some spooky treats for you with some little ghosts it comes with instructions step by step but of course you guys can always join me when I make mine and then it comes with this little ruler down here that you can use to measure your string and whatnot whenever it comes so there's that now let's look at all the pieces We've got some black twine with some silver in there. What else? Oh, we've got the um, Stampin' Dimensionals. I love these. I also love these little dots here, the little glue dots. We're going to look at this. And we've got some treat bags. They're little gusseted bags are gonna they look like they're tiny but they're actually gonna open up rather nicely there so you can fit a lot of treats in there like little skittles or M&Ms or even like one of those ghost um, peeps you can fit one of those in there so these let me get out my white paper again these have little spiders I thought they were stars but they're not they're little spiders on there and then what else we've got 
these like little spider webs on here. So let's see if I can stick this kind of in there so you can see the spider web better. So we've got some spider webs on that one. And then finally we've got just this little, oh, there we go. Like this orange striped bag here as well. So it's got two colors of orange there. Really cute little bags. I wish I would have seen these before I sent out your treats if, to my Paper Pumpkin subscribers because I also sent little treat bags out. <laughs> so not as cute as these for sure. So then it comes, but also what's this? looks like other little um, pieces of cardboard in here I'm gonna have to look and see what this is for oh you know what these are for I bet I'm not sure but I'm thinking that you can put these in the bottom here to make it like stand up I could be wrong this is just what I'm thinking probably could read directions and really find out but this is me just thinking ahead so yeah I think that's what it is because they do fit perfectly and it came in there so see how that makes it sit nice and flat so you can have your bag there and put your treats and then I don't know probably tie it at the end and make that nice bag so we'll see I'll look at the directions and we'll figure it out but it does come with these little cardboard as well and then we've got some stripes here which look like it's the base for something we've got a purple one and then it's got a line there so I'm assuming after let's just get these out let's just get the instructions out yep so you're going to put your design here and then fold it probably over the bag, I'm assuming, to keep everything closed. So this is just me. This is me without directions. So it comes in blue and then it comes in, let's see if they have the colors listed here. Uh, the colors they're using is basic black, basic gray, gorgeous grape, so that's the gorgeous grape. We've got mango melody, so that's this color here, and then some pumpkin pie in here as well. Where'd that pumpkin pie go? There it is. So I really like this mango melody. It's really pretty. So they come all different. This is really cool. And then here's those big bats. These are not stickers, they're just cutouts. We've got some ghosts. Those are super cute. We've got these uh, little jack-o'-lanterns here. And then this, I'm assuming, goes in back of the jack-o'-lantern to give it like a little face. Really cute. You guys, these would make cards so easily and let's see there this is just a punch out as well and then this one it looks to be like it's a sticker it is these little boo are stickers same with these eeks and the spooky so really cute no goriness at all which i didn't think there would be I was actually really excited for this because I do like to give like um, treats out to like the people who sit next to us at the football games and stuff like that. So we've all like kind of become a family in uh, rooting for our Cardinals. So we're all season ticket holders so we know each other. So I usually get them these and then I put like 
Cardinals M&Ms. <laughs> so I think it's cool. I think it's cute. But these are really cute. So if you like this, please give me a thumbs up. If you are a Paper Pumpkin subscriber of mine, you are already, um, you know, getting these great little items here. But again, I will choose one of you. It's not like a giveaway. It's just my way of saying thank you um, for subscribing to my Paper Pumpkin through me. So I think that's a cool little gift. So, all right, I guess that's everything and I cannot wait you guys, I'm going to make cards, I'm going to make bags, and if you are not already subscribed, make sure you subscribe because I'd love to put these together with you and may even do it live. So, all right, beauties, I will talk to you later. Have a wonderful day, and again, I'll put the link down below. Give me those thumbs ups, and then make sure you subscribe so you don't miss anything. All right, beauties, talk to you later. Bye!